Turning now to Richmond and a large police presence at Happy Trees Warehouse off Chamberlain Road in Richmond after a search warrant was executed at a cannabis trading event there. 8 News reporter Olivia Jakewith has been digging into what happened there. She joins us live tonight with the latest developments. Olivia. That's right, Eric Deanna. Well, authorities originally told us that they were on scene executing a narcotics search warrant. Specifically, though, that search warrant says police were on scene to investigate the possibility of possession with the intent to distribute both marijuana and mushrooms. And despite several hours on scene last night at this point, I'm told no arrests have been made. Overnight, a heavy police presence at the Happy Trees Warehouse in Richmond. Those who say they were there are reporting that dozens of customers and vendors at the Tree Trade Thursday event were zip tied, some even handcuffed, despite no arrests being made. Richmond police not confirming that information, though, as they say the investigation is ongoing. There was so much going on that it, it looked real bad. Brandon Fountain says he was there and that multiple police cars were at the warehouse for several hours. The search warrant showing that marijuana, money and paraphernalia were taken. We had to come outside and sit and go through questionnaires and it, it just was a bad feeling. Josiah Ickes is the co-founder of Happy Trees. He says it feels like a safe space was violated. Our background is that we're an ag agricultural supply store and we help bring the community together and that's been our big focus. It's people who just want to get together and you know hang out you know and it just turned into something really scary. Others who say they were at the event tell me it's meant for trading but that some donations are accepted something that's specifically prohibited in the code of Virginia. For the community hopefully as a whole we can get certain laws passed and a lot of agreement between politics and community smokers to the point where we can function and we can continue to have events like this in, in a closed environment and in public. Now, Ica says they are holding another event at the warehouse tonight just to try to bring people together. As for police, we're still waiting to hear back on exactly what they were looking for and if any charges could be coming. For now, live in Richmond, Olivia Jakewith, 8 News.